Hey guys, oh, what's up? Courtney here. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to me. If this is your first time with me. Thank you so much for clicking on my video. I know you did not have to. I really do appreciate it. If you like it, will you please give me a thumbs up, tap subscribe, hit ring and your bell. I will support you back. You know I will. If this is not your first time with me, then hey you guys, oh, what is up? How's everybody doing? Happy Thanksgiving week. Um, I do have to work on Thanksgiving, so I just decided to sit down and have a nice little taggy chat with you guys tonight so that's what we're doing we're doing a tag and this tag was orig originated by a woman um named monica from monica ap channel but i did just watch the tag on beth's channel and that is little little betsy underscore 79 i've actually seen a few people do this tag um i saw uh nat from little miss nat do it and several other people do it and I think it's an amazing tag. I think it's a very good tag um, for creators to get to know other creators and for our audience and subscribers like you to get to know us a little better and just kind of find out, you know, a little more about us and, you know, how we see our channels. And it is called the Part-Time YouTuber Tag. So if you guys would like to see my tag answers, all that good stuff, you know the drill. Keep on watching and I'll be right back. And I really haven't been doing much makeup um, here recently as far as like makeup videos. Um, I have, you know, I've been telling my friends, it's, I've been feeling a little bit uninspired. Um, and I think it's just the time of the year it is, you know, it's just the holiday season's coming. So anyways, so I'm glad to sit down and be able to kind of just talk to you guys and um, maybe this will answer some of the questions. So, <laughs> um, and there are, I believe, eight. Yes, eight. I had to write them down because I forget everything. I would write them on my hand, but it's too much to write. So, we're just going to go ahead and get started with this part-time YouTubers tag. Okay, so number one, um, what is your main gig? Um, do you work full-time? Are you a student? Are you a parent? Spill the beans. Well, unfortunately... I can't really, I can tell you that I am in the medical field and I work in a trauma center. Um, I cannot tell you guys exactly what I do, um, and I'm sure you can understand, but I do help people. Um, I have a very important job, and um, I love my job. Um, it's very, very rewarding, and at the same time, it's um, it's it can be... It can be tough. So, so yes, I do work full time. I'm not a student. I'm a parent. I have two sons. My oldest, he is 20. He will be 21 in April. And then my youngest, he will be 14 on Thanksgiving. So, Blake and Reese. I have to work every Thanksgiving, but um, we've always had, you know, some family here, um, whether, you know, my husband's side or whatever where we can kind of go and, and hang out and then I would just leave and go to work well this year not so much <laughs> so we are just gonna be um I guess I guess I'm gonna have to just take him up to, to work and you know let him pig out with us at work so uh, we do have a dog named Max he's as sweet as he can be he's my son's he's Reese's dog so, um, he's as sweet as he can be. Uh, we haven't had him very long, but it, <laughs> Reese is in love with him. I'm the grandmom pup mom. Grand pup mom. <laughs> so, but, so that's pretty much what that is. Uh, question number two is, what made you want to start YouTube? Well, <laughs> if you know me, then you know the answer to this. Um, and if you don't, then I can just kind of give you a rundown, a, a quick, the quickest rundown I can. Um, in 2017, um, I got sick. Um, I was diagnosed um, with cancer and I was able to fortunately have surgery and the cancer was removed. And That was October of 2017. And I started my channel in Mar May of 2018, so I haven't been on YouTube very long. 
But the reason why I started is because I needed something to do that was positive, that I felt good about, and I knew that I enjoyed. I never thought that I would get 10 people, much less, you know, the people that I've gotten, you know, subscribers. Um, and, and I never, ever imagined I would meet so many amazing people and amazing content creators and amazing makeup artists and just people who I consider my friends. And, uh, I just, it's, I'm so glad that I did it. And the reasons why I did it were to get, to get out of my own head. After going through something like that, it, it, it changes you in a way where you kind of, you need somewhere, you need an outlet, you need somewhere to go, you need somewhere where you can, you know, do something that you enjoy. And this was a thing that I knew that I could do because I already had a collection of makeup. <laughs> I knew that I could do and I would still be home with my family when I wasn't working and I'd still be able to, to, to do what I needed to do with my kids. I survived and I wanted to do something to help others. You know, I mean, it's just, if I could help one person start their own channel or feel better about themselves or learn something new, you know, that's just, that, that's that's why I started my channel. That's why I started my channel. There's many reasons why, but that's basically where it started. So that's gonna be my answer. Number three, what is your channel about? And do you stick to one niche or do you cover a few? Um, I, beauty, beauty based. Now I have done some other things on my channel. Um, when they took away the live, um, where you had to have a thousand, this is the reason why I'm striving to get 1k. It's the reason why I'm doing the 1k giveaway. I want a thousand subscribers so that I can do lives from my phone that I record from. I record with my phone. It's an iPhone 7, <laughs> you know, it's not a new, new phone, but I want to be able to do lives from my phone because that's when I had so much fun, you know, interacting with other people live and being able to go and do my porch chats and just talk about things and just, you know, sit here and have conversations with, with, with you guys. And it was just, it was, it was, it was amazing to me. And when they took that away, oh my goodness, I was so upset. So, you know, other than beauty and, and the things that you see, you know, my lives were my, my lives were my other content or was my other content. Um, I know Little Miss Nat had said something about a video that I had done recently. Um, I got together with a teacher from the, the local high school and I did a teaching video and published it later. It was for the drill team. It was actually for the color guard and they, it got misunderstood, number one. <laughs> I did a look based on what the teacher asked me to do, and it was basically a new age um, warrior type um, makeup look, and it was a teaching tool. And I did post that pri uh, public because um, the season was over, and I wanted people to see that if they needed to, if they wanted to teach, you know, to inspire other people to, to, to help others, if they want to teach them how to do something, hey, maybe you can use this as a guideline, you know, um, you know, I've really put a lot of work into that video. If you like to see it, it's really long, but it's, it's teaching, um, you know, a bunch of, of teenagers, high schoolers, who didn't have much experience with makeup so that 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 definitely is something different that i don't normally do in the lives um but yeah if you have a chance go check that out maybe i'll if, i'll probably forget but there's no words on it it's just my face and it's, it's i have this makeup on it and it's really cool so let me get comfortable here <laughs> I like I would like to branch out into other things, but I need my lives. I need to get my life back. I need 1K so I can do lives on my cell phone. That's that is that is what I want the most right now. And I feel so so close but so far away at the same time and it's just ah so 
moving past that. Number four, did you always know YouTube would be a side gig or did or do you want to be full time a full time YouTuber? Um it's it's a sad gig for me. I I I I would love to be a full time YouTuber. I would love to be able to um, support my family. From you know, I mean that's. I didn't think that's what I wanted to do. If I ever had a chance to do it, I would do it. But with that being said, I'm gonna do it the right way. I'm gonna do it. if 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 I do if I were to. It wouldn't be like I would. I, I couldn't stop working with patients. I couldn't stop doing what I'm doing. But I could, if I could do this full time and then you know switch it up, I, I would. But I would do it the right way, and honestly, and you know catch a break, you know, or something like that. But I don't believe in cheating. I don't believe in buying, you know, people to, to, you know, watch your channel or, or, you know, any of that. I believe it's awful for, for people to do that. And it's very disingenuous. And, um, you know, I'm not going to sell my soul to the devil to, to, to make this a full-time job. And I'm not going to you know, endorse or promote things that I don't believe in to make this a full-time job because then it wouldn't be, you know, genuine and wouldn't be real to me. I don't think I, I will ever be able to because I believe that I'm too old and I believe that there's so too much talent out there and I can't, I'm not quite <laughs> that talented because I'm very classic with my makeup. Um, but I do know people that I believe are going to go really, really far, and I just hope they don't forget about us small people. So <laughs> we all need to to respect each other and respect each other's content and originality is a big thing on YouTube. And if you do have something that is original and you feel is original then take ownership in it and be happy for yourself. You know, like that's, that's my biggest, you know, thing for advice for other creators, you know, be, take pride in your originality and, and don't let anybody take it from you. You know, this, like this tag, for example, you know, Monica, I mean, you know, this is an awesome tag. You know, this is original. This is nice. This is, this is, this is amazing, you know, so, you know, credit to you, girl, you know, I, I just, I feel very strongly about that, too. It's the reason I wanted to do this tag, so it's, it might be, it might be kind of long, sorry. Um, number five, what's your schedule like? When do you film and when do you edit? Um, I'm a night shift, I work night shift, so I am a, I work full-time nights, and then I am a beauty vlogger by day. But really, I'm not a beauty blogger by day, vlogger by day, because I usually film at night when I'm off. I, I'm a night owl because of my, my work, so by the time I get off of my night shifts, I'm usually sleeping in the day. So, I film when I can. I film when I can. I usually film, you know, I film when I can. And sometimes I can't. Sometimes I can't, especially when it's time-consuming stuff. You know, there are there are time-consuming things. You know, boxes come, which I'm not getting any more boxes. <laughs> I'm canceling my, I've canceled my boxes. But, you know, I mean, you know, community on YouTube, you want to be the person who gets that review up and lets people see or or gets that review up and, and gives a different perspective on it. That's the way to grow. And with my schedule and all that, I just believe that that's the reason, part of the reason why I haven't grown as much as I want to. But you know what? It doesn't matter because I'm doing it honestly and I'm doing it slowly. And it's like, I guess it's like losing weight. <laughs> you lose weight slowly and you keep it off. Well, I kind of, I've kind of, Put it that way. It's the slow. The slower I gain subscribers, then I'll keep them, right? <laughs> so, and then I edit. I try to edit my videos as soon as I, as soon as I do them. Like when I get done with this, I'll try to edit it um, and just have it ready because I don't have Wi-Fi at home. I don't have. 
I don't have I don't have good internet access period it takes a long time for my videos to upload so um, number six how do you keep your channel organized um, do you plan videos ahead or film when you feel like it um, it depends if you know if it's a collab um, something like that obviously it's planned yes. and I have always tried to film videos and I've done really good with it until I didn't have internet at the house anymore I did really good with keeping videos in the bank I call it in the bank where as they were either in my phone ready to go to be uploaded or they were already uploaded and they're on private or unlisted or whatever but here recently I have not been doing a whole lot of banked videos because I've been trying to keep up with a lot of collabs that I've been doing and a lot of time sensitive material so hence me saying that I haven't done just sat down and just done a makeup look or a makeup tutorial in a while so and if it has it's been a really super speedy one and, and nothing um extravagant so um you know that's and i do i do film when i feel like it so I, i'm a big believer in playlists like that's how i keep like my videos organized um but you know i, I have to film when i have to film like i said in the last question i have to film when i have to film and I used to be good about it. No, I'm not. So, hopefully, you know, after the holidays, you know, I will be able to get back into a, a better rhythm of doing that. Um, you know, I'm really hoping so. Um, it's been a rough year. It's been a rough year for me. And you guys haven't seen it, but it, it has. It's been a r rough year for me. And, um, and I'm not going to quit because I don't quit. <laughs> I don't quit. I, I, I get... I accomplish goals so. <laughs> but I would love I, I do like to plan ahead if I can but my channel is organized into playlists and every time I upload I throw the video into one or more playlists so if you ever are looking for anything or whatever there's playlists and there's there yeah all that <laughs> um number seven how do you how do you feel about sponsored videos um and have or would you ever do one I, I don't I don't this is the only question in this tag that I'm, I, I kind of feel is moot um I don't I don't I don't sponsor videos are are fine I mean you know I guess it depends on what you're sponsoring if you're, as long as you're sponsoring something that you believe in or sponsoring something that you um you know are telling the truth about um, I don't feel like there's a problem with sponsored videos. If someone came to me from, you know, a place that was a decent place and the people were nice there or whatever and they asked me to, and they wanted to sponsor my video, of course I would let them sponsor my video. But that's not going to happen. So, <laughs> but if, if someone ever came and asked me, if it was, it depending on who it was, you know, I mean, I'm not... It, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't know. That that was the only question. Number seven was the only question. I was kind of like, hmm. Like, I don't know who would say no to that. But I guess people do have their own opinions about sponsorships. I don't know. I just I just don't see a problem with it. You know, we work so hard and we take so much of our time to to create content and, and to try to, you know, further ourselves and to try to better ourselves and to try to... Um, you know make the best content for you guys and that takes a lot of time and it does take a lot of um you know effort you know filming getting ready to film what are you going to fit you know it's it does it does and, and and i didn't really realize how much it did take until i did realize <laughs> and that was you know more so you know, like right now, I'm I, obviously I have a better filming situation than I did at the beginning, but I did not at the beginning. So if you're just starting out, if you're wanting to just start out, there's a few people out there that I have pushed to start channels and because I knew they wanted to. It's, there's going to be something. I feel like there's going to be something, you know, with all of us who are striving to, you know, you know, make this full time if possible or catch a break or to get noticed or whatever. I mean, there's so many of us, but you know, we all have the same goal. We all have the same goal. If, if it means creating amazing content and hoping that one day you may get, you know, recognized or whatever, 
and you can accept that or you can you you cannot accept that you know you don't have to say yes to sponsorships you know so it's like you know that's that's a personal preference I could care less if someone like I said sponsorships are cool I think it's awesome I, th I think it's great that people get sponsored you know so if you're you are sponsored and and it's kudos to you kudos to you that's amazing I mean I, I would be proud <clears throat> number eight what do you think is the biggest challenge of doing YouTube part-time? Well, to me, doing YouTube part-time is a challenge because I sleep. I sleep. Sleep and balancing, you know, family life with doing... And, and the thing is, is, is I have learned very well how to... When I need to film. When I can film. You know, and, and I do that. And I have made sacrifices on my channel and, 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 and doing this as a hobby. Because this is a hobby to me. This is a hobby to me that I would love to make go further that I don't think will. But I do have confidence and I'm hoping that it will. So the challenge for me is timing and, and my schedule and the fact that sometimes I just don't feel like doing it. And that here recently, like I said at the beginning of the video, I've had to kind of push myself. So it's a struggle. Like I have been struggling and, and I'm not going to lie to you guys. I always told you guys, I'll take it to truth no matter what. I usually don't get very personal on, um, on, on YouTube at all. I, I, I try to keep things very, you know, you know, even and, and, you know, sometimes I know you guys can see, you know, that something's not right and maybe maybe not you know but normally if you think that it's probably not right it's not right and and if you watch me all the time you know I know some of you out there who have been with me since the beginning and I cannot thank you enough for that and I know who you are and and I appreciate it so much and I'm so proud to, to be able to say that so and there's so many people who are so talented and so amazing who deserve so much more credit than what they get and I meet I meet them all the time you know and it's and it's just like wow there's so many of us you know like w what do we you know it's 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 so you have to choose my fellow beauty youtubers we have to choose small channels we have to choose are we going to continue to do this as a hobby because we love it and you know we enjoy it and we want to help others or is it going to flake out and we're going to start dropping like flies and going against each other and, you know i would rather look at it in a positive way and say you know hey you do what you got to do you know if you feel like it's taking too much time if you feel like it's not worth it anymore if you feel like you're not happy anymore you know then don't 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 do it don't put yourself in that situation but if it's something that you do enjoy and if it's something that you feel like is worth it and 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 it makes you happy and you could sit there and just geek out on makeup with some money and that still makes you smile then keep doing it because that's what we need to to live life and to be happy and to be, you know, ourselves. So all I can just say is thank you to the people I've met. My YouTube friends are my friends, <laughs> are my friends. And there's a couple that are very close to me and that I call, I call very close friends, you know, close friends, best friends. And it's amazing. I never thought I would get that from YouTube. So that's another challenging thing for me is to accept that I have been able to find that on YouTube. So I love this tag and I know I've taken it way, way, way too far. And I'm sorry <laughs> as far as like the questions like I went overboard. But that's just me. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed it. Um, please feel free to comment and let me know what you think. If you know, you heard something that you disagree with, that's okay. Let me know. I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't mind that. I just don't want to argue. I don't argue. 
so. <laughs> um, but thank you so much for watching. And Beth, your tag was super cute. And that yours was too. Um, please make sure you go and check out the links that I leave below. Um, the creator of the tag is Monica AP Channel. Her tag answers are amazing, and she seems like a very, very, very sweet lady, and I would really like to get to know her better. She's she's really, really kind, and um, if you're a creator and you're questioning yourself, here is my olive branch extended to you, and I've said this before in my lives. That's why I love the lives so much, but I've said this before in my lives. If you feel down or if you feel like you need to talk, all of my information is always on my um, Let's Be Friends thing underneath my description, you know, in my description. You know, if you need help with something, if you want to collaborate with me, reach out. I'm giving you the olive branch. I'm extending it to you. So, anyways, thank you guys so much to my subscribers who don't have channels. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for, for the support. Your comments are so sweet. And honestly, that's really what keeps me going it is when i feel like i don't want to do it i read comments and i'm just like okay i gotta do this so thank you all so 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 much i hope y'all have a wonderful thanksgiving and i hope you guys enjoy the time with your family love your family <sighs> tomorrow's never promised and you know just enjoy the holidays and enjoy the time that you have so i will see you guys in my next video if you like, tap the bell, subscribe, you know the drill. <laughs> I love you all, but I won't argue with you. Bye.